Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Friend Bo. So in the last episode, we finally got all those bits and pieces for Mr. Mage in there, and uh, we managed to get all the items but one back. In this episode, we'll be getting that final item and moving on. There was a minor issue last time, and the minor issue is that we recorded almost to the end of the game, and then uh, the moment I hit stop on my recording, it flatlined and went blank, even though I was watching it do all the scaling and everything. So, uh, we're re-recording because it deleted my audio on me. I have no idea how that happened, but this stuff happens to me every other week. So, uh, it's unfortunate, but it's what we're doing. Now, I had to replay up to the, like, up to this point in the game, just this chapter. So, uh, I already know everything that's going to happen, but it's still going to be fun and amazing. And it's been a couple months, so, uh, I don't remember everything. So, the, you know, it should be fine. So, as we know, our final item we're looking for has... Oh, kitty, I have to get the wand from the giant locust doll. Yes, Fran, finally, my dear. The last quest, let's go. So, uh, we, we just have to get the stupid wand back. And I, if I'm remembering right... No, that's not to do it. Um, hit this one and have it... No? Maybe this, and then this? I honestly don't know how to do this part. Just, just keep working. Yeah, keep going no, I got, I got, I, I, don't worry. I already got it. Okay, this one goes down, this one goes up, and then this one goes down. And I already have it! Because it's that simple. Oh, great! This was the last task. Now I can go home. Or can you? Oh, yeah, yes, actually dun, dun, we can. Dun. So I'm hoping we didn't forget to do anything here, because I had to replay this. <laughs> oh well, I'm sure it's fine. Uh... Sup, wizard man? Yeah, How Mr. Wizard. Do? The great locust is taking care of my wand. Hurry up and bring it to me. I've almost found the greatest answer of them all. How this that fucking is... magician makes a rabbit come out of a hat. Goddamn, how does he do it? Boom! Uh, it won't work. Dang it, I'm not a magician! I mean, you told Annie at the beginning of the game you weren't a magician, so you should have already known that, Gabriel. Well, it's been a few months. Here she wants, it's been like Sir one Wizard. Month. It has been oh, over this two. Music, yo, it's been on. two and a half oh, months, so Cassie. It's been two and a half months since we recorded. It has not. Oh. It's been like one month. It has been two and a half months. I have the files. I checked them earlier today. It was it was late May when we recorded. It is now mid July. Oh, it's magnificent. Splendid. You did it. Really? But where are the stones? Can I borrow them? I can't lend you the stones. These stones are very, very special. What I can do is Unlike place you, the stones bitch. on the locks of the door, but you, you're the only one who can turn the key and actually open the door. Oh, I see. The king told me he would show me where the door is. Ah, uh, then we should go and talk to him, don't you think? Hmm, wait, I suspect that you could return home looking like a tree. Oh, yes. I, yes, I almost forgot. Can you bring my human body back? Yes, I can. This is exciting. I haven't done this in hundreds of years. Let's make a human, yes. Do you want to make a human? <laughs> it doesn't give, have to be a give human. Give me your clothing. I need to smell it. <laughs> Alrighty, friends. Here, you into some clothing. kinky shit there, sir. Mm, let me smell this. Oh god! <laughs> yes, this can work. We it will make a so human. Bad. Oh, this Jesus is so Christ. exciting! Fran, you should be scared. Run away. Good. Now go to the center of the Star of Atherista and think about your body, your head, your legs, and the other leg, and don't make any your modifications tits. to make yourself look better. Give yourself a third and arm. Your arm. Become Vishnu. Them. Now concentrate. Randomly selected elements. Find your path to the true essence. Become Fran the human now! Get Fran the tree a little bit more. Yeah. Yeah, it's not a pleasant view. I like I like Fran the human. Like I like your clothes. They're cute. But I also really like Fran the tree's hair. I like Fran the tree much better than Fran the human. She's like dead looking. Huh. Oh, shut Are up. you alright? Uh -huh. Yeah, like I might have just killed you, but like, oh, fucking what get happened? pull out just to come in here and clean the ass up. Is it done? Oh wow, thank you so much, sir. You really are a great wizard. Yes, that's my name, 
Great Wizard because of the greatness. And not because I uh, named myself that after I pulled a rabbit out of a hat a few years ago and then forgot how to a few days ago. Also, I just realized he's dripping things into the hat. Yeah, he's trying to fucking put a potion in there to figure out how it works. Oh, okay. Hmm. I, th I think we have to go to the king now so you can show me the door. Yes, uh, I'll be right there. I have to finish something. I'll be there. Go now. <laughs> he has to masturbate because after smelling your clothes, he's just... Ah, oh, he just, he has a mighty need. No, I'm pretty sure he wanted to do that stupid magic trick, but all right, Cassie, be weird. I am always weird. It is literally the default. All right. I'm going to make it uh, summer. Biggest honey, honey cold. Summer is nice. No, oh, whatever. You mean honeysickles? Honey combs. Everything is fine. It feels hey, like creepy heaven. fan. That's a cute dress, though. What are you? Leave Mr. Midnight alone. That Mr. Midnight looks fucking brain dead. Like, look at ours compared to that one. Is your head playing with you again? Can't you see yourself in the mirror? I'm not you. I'm not. Let Mr. Midnight go now. That hat is very dark. They kill the traitors. Because that's what he is, Fran. Don't you see? My kitty's not a traitor. He promised to be by my side. He promised. I love how the cat's just sitting there. your mommy and like daddy did. Yeah. He promised to take good care of you. Wake up, Fran. You're surrounded by traitors. Leave me alone. Leave my friend alone. I'm the only one you have, Fran. I'm the only one who's always by your side. Now let's get rid of this traitor, eh? <laughs> what do you say? Let's be happy. Let's be so very, very happy together. Mr. Midnight, oh god, I've seen things. Go away, go Mr. away. Mr. Midnight just me. looks like he's totally calm to me. Just like, yeah, this happens every Tuesday. That's whatever. This bitch always has visions. I don't fucking know. Farhan, what's wrong? Why are you crying? I'm crazy, sir. I'm totally crazy. The doctors were right. Because you're but a fucking you're tree man. Crazy. That's why she's I'm crying. Very sorry that you feel that way. You should be happy now. You found the stones, you became human again. That is very great indeed. Also, I want to point out the fact that she saw less fucked up things when she was a tree than she was a human. I mean, she saw a few weird things, but it was only a couple. My dear, let me wipe those tears. I don't want to hurt you, my dear. I feel like I'm about to do it at any moment. You won't, I know that, because you love me. Yeah, kitty, And the I power of love is much. bullshit. Fry, remember what I told you. If you love, you are alive. And that is the only thing that matters. So you people that are antisocial and don't really like anybody, fuck those people. They're dead. You always find the power to fight those monsters in you. And also, he didn't say that about anyone else. He just said it about Fran because she's weak. No. Now let's go and fight everybody. the gate so you can go home now. Yes. Yes, let's do it. Also, you're talking over me, Cassie. I'm trying to read the game. Oh, fuck the game. No, that's They weird. can read the dialogue. No, I'm not. Uh, We're here to give commentary. I read things. Here we are. I don't care if yes, you read things. But where's the door? Oh, right. I have to make it visible. But are you sure you want to go back? I'm sure, sir. All right. Here we go. The human must leave. Open the door into her reality. Let the human return home. Why must your Let's Plays always make me yawn? Oh wow, we're going home, kitty. Oh, is the other king? Good day to you, sir. I brought the stone so this lovely creature can go home. Is that right? Sir? Yes, I noticed. Thank you, sir. I'm very nervous. It would be that, strange that's to be far. That's oh. Fran. Oh, I, I thought it was. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, sir. I'm very nervous. <laughs> It'll be strange to be far away my friend just went through puberty all of a sudden. Did her balls drop? Then don't leave. I can make you a place to stay, a very magical place. Wizard, she has to leave. I received a message from one of the walks. Then why the hell a moment ago did you offer yeah, for us to stay? Yeah, why did you ask don't if she be wanted a dick. to stay? If don't you be said a she dick. Ha what the fuck, if king man? If she's not ready. Oh, I see. What are you talking about? Ready for what? Come on, but it's place dick. the stones. We have no time to lose. She's trying to figure it out. The reality's failing. Oh, 
But get ready for what? Now, you know what the Vlog has told you about facing your truth. Ah, uh, yes, I think I remember. Well, should I? Wait, how did he know about that? Yes, go ahead, wizard, sir. Magic stones create the lock that only the human can break. Well, now it's time for Fran to be the key. You're the only way you can open this now. I don't know why, but every time I start recording, every time I start recording, we both start yawning, and it's the best thing in the world. We weren't yawning before this. Oh, wow, all right, let's see. Fucking leaving! <laughs> I think I'm oh, just I can stay actually do here it. <laughs> oh, I can actually do that. I thought they would stop me. I like that okay. pink one. It is very pretty. Um. Why does it matter which one I start with? Because it's gotta go in an order. Fuck you, Gabe. This makes no sense. Why would I have to start with that one? Because fuck you! All right, time to fall through the wormhole. Goodbye, I friends. victory again. Goodbye, happy it, tree friends. You go home now. I'm so excited. I wish I could. I wish I could leave you something so you can remember me. We won't forget you. You're a very special creature. Oh, I almost forgot. Pelantris gave me this for you. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Tell Pelantris I wish I could help him with his wounds. I gave my aid patches to the girl in a hospital, but anyways... I'll tell him, don't worry, Polantris is better now. Oh, before you go, you must know. There's so before much shit they're telling us, rally, like, oh shit, we forgot about the this! Woods. The shit. woods are a kind of invisible passage between our realities, and you may encounter terrible creatures that want to eat you. But just run, they are quite slow. And you're telling me this now? Huh, that sounds very scary. Friend, it's almost you like know. you didn't want me to have second thoughts or something. <laughs> Don't worry, you'll be fine. It's almost like <laughs> you're gonna so. throw me through this portal if I tell you I don't want to go. Oh, well, Mr. Midnight, say goodbye. Let's go now. Goodbye, gentlemen. I had a great time. I, I like you very much. Them goodbye. The cat's talking. They. I mean. There's the yeah. giant fluffy. They're walking trees and and vegetables. Yeah. I know. So to them, a talking cat is probably not a big deal. But there's still. There's a flying. There's a flying cat dragon. Shut up. <sighs> Play your side scroller. Yeah, I forgot what this was at first, actually. I almost called it an RPG, and you probably would have murdered me if I did that. Oh, are you kidding me? Are you that dumb again? Shut up, okay? I know what RPG stands for. I just don't know what games fit in the description. You called Mario an RPG, and yes, there was an RPG. Because it is! Your role-playing is Mario. Go fuck yourself. Oh my god, Cass. Sorry, goddamn. You are absolutely ridiculous. And since I already played this part, I have to edit in the achievement now. Thanks, Cass. Ruining everything. This is so obviously my fault. You did a lot better this time than last time. Last time it took him like five times to get through. <laughs> I don't know who you're time. talking about. It was perfect. Chapter 4, Part 1. My imaginary friend. Okay. <laughs> Your imaginary fucking way you got through that goddamn thing. Goodness, the door opened. Wow, interesting. It's almost like this door is magical or something. Come on, Mr. My Knight, let's find a way out where it's we are. It's almost like you just came from a world with talking tree people and talking vegetable people. Oh, Fran, I hope we can find. Wait, I hope we can find home soon. I'm starving. Mr. My Knight, look, I think we're at the other side of the bridge. Do you remember the one we tried to cross before we fell into Thirsta and I died fell, and became a tree? Was pushed. Ah, the, the, the tomato, tomato. <laughs> yes, I remember. Great, let's keep on going, Kitty. We have to be careful now. All right, well, uh... We have to be careful now. Oh, look at these pills. This is very ground. odd. Tied when to a we string. Found in Thirsta, there was no water. Gotta get these. Miss Moonlight shines. It's very romantic. Oh, there's the bridge. I knew we were on the other side. Okay. Um... My foot. You trying to cut my toes off? My boots are quite dirty. I have to clean them when I get home. I didn't realize you could actually interact with that. Okay. Now, uh, let's draw on the cat's face. <laughs> Fine. I 
Are these my pills? Wow, but where are they going? They're dumb, leaving you, bitch. Dumb That's like, yo girl. shit. Home. Pills don't move, huh? You wanna show me the way back home? Kitty can walk up to them, but I can't. Ah. Oh no, I shouldn't have touched the pills. Bad friend. Bad, bad. No, it's not. Burn bad. it. <laughs> yeah. I, you burn yourself. I, That's a bad idea. Cass, you told me to burn it last time. I know, last time, but shh, we're pretending that didn't happen, remember? <laughs> Fucker. <laughs> Fran, you were already here. Well, I wasn't expecting you until 2.35. And as I see it, you're not trapped anymore. Interesting. Anyway, let me introduce myself. I am Itward, your faithful friend. Itward? Do I know you from somewhere? You seem familiar. Yes, I'm the creature of the night. We've been playing together. I hoped you'd get to Mr. Midnight back, you see. This really? line right huh. here. I Don't think continue I if you say this. I think I managed quite well to find my kitty on my own. No, you did not, bitch! Okay? The fucking mechanical cat helped you. Fucking the toad helped you. Literally, like, Itward is the one that opened the door for you to see the toad to get out there to talk to him to deal with the twins. You fucking selfish bitch. Continue. Oh, yeah. Hey, aren't you the one that made the sisters mad? No, it wasn't me making the sisters mad. They believed it was me, you see, but that's because they never looked into themselves. What do you mean they never looked into themselves? They blamed me instead of facing the fact that their parents never loved them. But they let's stop talking about that sisters, shall we? Don't you recognize me, dear friend? The long man with the top hat? Uh, I'm gonna keep my references to myself. I always came by nine told you stories what was when the we reference? were just a little baby. It doesn't matter. Abraham I came Lincoln? you after you imagined me. But I'm not imaginary, you see. I'm part of your reality. Did I imagine you? You look quite familiar, yes. I can't deny that. I exist because you exist. The truth is that you were able to imagine me because I already existed. Anyway, we don't have time to talk about this right now. Actually, I'm here to take you home. Follow me. Take me home? I can't let you do that. I don't know you. I won't hurt you. I'm not made out of darkness. I'm your friend. Hmm. Alright, you seem nice. I'll go with you, but I won't trust you yet. That's fine. Come on now. I have something to show you. I don't think I've ever wanted to fuck a skeleton more than I want to fuck Itward. Uh, Jax? No, Jack. Jack is meant to be with Sally. I wouldn't take him away from her. Okay. Well, you're kind of weird. Behold, yeah, I am. the Itward flying machine. What do you think? I love it. It's many buttons to press. Push. Push. Down, I say press because that's actually correct. Yes, with this gorgeous piece of machinery, I'll take you home. We'll fly as soon as I fix the details. Wait, because it. Besides, it's not 2:35 yet. That sounds great, but. What is it about 2.35, sir? I don't understand. It's when time becomes slower, and that gives us a chance to enter the ultra reality. I love that the time gets slower at such a random interval. Like, not midnight, midnight like it's, everyone would think. It's, it's just 2.35. 2 plus 3 plus 5. Okay, that's great. That happens with so many other numbers. Inside the ultra reality, we can travel wherever we want to go. Right now, we are standing on the endless limits of the second reality. But you are a part of the third reality. Do you understand? Yes, I do understand. It sounds insane. But, sir, should I just wait until you're done fixing the machine? Wait? Of course not. You can help by getting water and fireberries, alright? Alright. It's better to do something than nothing at all, I guess. And by help, Great. he means do literally everything while I stand in front of this fucking thing for a few minutes until you give me all the shit. Or, he, you know, he could be repairing things and just, like, see us coming and walk over here to, to greet us. Great, here's my amazing handmade bucket for the water. I made it myself. Alright, it's better to do something than nothing. Oh, well, I guess I read the other one. Ah, and the fire berries. You realize which berries to pick up because of the fire. Alright, sir, but can I just ask? Why do we need the berries in the water? Ah, uh, well, the berries are incredibly good fuel. They last many, many hours. And the water is to get rid of the dirt. The Kamalas. Oh, Kamalas, I see. I hope they don't come around the flying machine. We never know, but we do know that they don't like water, yes? 
Oh, and darling, I almost forgot. Your medicine, you need it. Some things are still invisible to your eyes, you see. Here. Invisible to my eyes? Hmm, I see. Well, thank you. I was trying to catch the pills earlier, but the trap caught me first. Oh, yes. Yeah, sorry about that. I'm sorry. I needed to get your attention somehow. It's okay, sir. I defeated the trap in, like, one second. Anyway, I'll get the fire bears in the water. I'll be right back. Great, and I'll be preparing the machine. Yeah, he's doing things over there. See him Wow, look that. at that. Look at that wrench tightening. Yeah. So impressive. Yeah, better than you. So we're in the ultra reality again. Yeah, we Oh, are. so I just realized the eyes, like, give off this weird thing. That's kind of odd. Uh... Get out, get out, you're trespassing on my territory. Huh? Excuse me, I thought you were dead. How can you possibly think that? You have no manners, young lady. I'm very sorry, but you seem to be all rotten and bloody. Me? Rotten and bloody? I think you're misunderstanding the situation. What do you... Why do you say that, Mr. Moose? Mr. Moose? But I'm not a moose. I'm a deadly worm. A, excuse me? A deadly worm? No, no, a dead... Not a deadly worm. A deadly worm. A deadly worm. I don't go around killing creatures. I just give back to the soil what creatures took from it and don't need it anymore. But I only see a talking moose. Where are you? Just a second. I'm going to grab a drink of water because my throat's actually starting to kill me. That's what you get for voicing all the characters and not giving me nothing. I'm voicing the next character that comes up. Uh, there are a few characters coming up that you voiced, remember? I don't Down here, remember, creature, but yeah. Can you see me? Oh, there you are. You're so tiny. He's so cute Hello. with little sights for friend. arms. Hello, friend. Can I ask, why did you touch the moose in the first place? Normally, only scavengers would touch dead animals. Are you one? Of course not. I'm trying to see if I could climb on to reach the fireberries. I see. I think it's possible. The moose is still very sturdy and solid. But the fireberries are on fire. You can hurt yourself. Yes, I see the fire, but I have to take them somehow. Good luck with that. Climb on now. I'll keep working. Thank you, sir. So, we obviously can't really do anything with this yet. I just want to talk there. Also, yeah. I want to point something out. Hmm? This direction for home. This direction for hell. Just want to point I mean, out. they're the same place. You know. Okay, mine. Mine. <clears throat> Hello, are those shiny insects that got stuck in the tree because of curiosity? Are you those? Okay, whatever. We usually get stuck, yes. How did you know this? You are not one of us. I met some of your kind before. I helped them to get free from curiosity. Ah, that is very nice of you. Curiosity can lead us to unexpected situations. Yes, I think curiosity is a good thing, but are you stuck? Cass. I'll take care of it in a minute. Hold on. Cass. Cass. Okay. Okay! Hi. So I'm supposed to read this, right? Yes. Okay. Shit, I already wait, forgot wait, 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 what wait, wait, voice wait. I was using. Uh. Talk? Hi? Okay, it's not moving your mic anymore. It was before. Um, and you're going like, yeah, 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 yeah. Not at all. We're just trying to make our hair the longest hair ever. Wow, that sounds amazing. Good luck. I have to go now. Bye. I have no interest in you as a person. I know. She's just like, yeah, I'm good. Bye. See you later, friend. Well, I mean... Oh, no. I can't reach the water from here. I wonder if there's something that we could use to get down there. Hmm. I need help, please. Would you want me to tie the bucket to your beautiful hair? Tie a bucket to our hair? Why, that sounds insane. I, it's a totally different voice already, but you know. It's not insane at all. I need water from under the cliff, but I can't reach it. I need to use your beautiful long hair as a rope. Please help me. Also, you're touch you're smacking your mic. I'm not touching my mic. It's sounding like you're moving it. <laughs> you gonna press the... Did I read it yet? I don't remember. Yes, you did. Okay. Alright, we'll help you. Uh, mm -hmm. yeah, <clears throat> Alright, we'll help you tie the bucket real tight. Oh, thank you. You're very nice. Fill up the whole bucket, please. 
like I drop the bucket. Like a fist. I would laugh so hard if she just dropped the bucket. Oh my gosh, shit, sorry. The bucket is now full of water. Ah, oh, thank you, shiny insects. I have to go now. I have to go home. Home is somewhere we all wish to belong, but does home belong somewhere? What? I'm sorry, I don't really understand the question. It was a rhetorical question. I just wanted to say that. You are your own home. Welcome yourself inside. You will find many doors to open. You're popping your mic. I don't know what that means. Okay, well, I'm not doing anything, so like... You're getting too close to your mic. <sighs> Fine, whatever. Oh, that sounds mysterious and beautiful. I'll try to do that some other time. Bye. Sometime that isn't now, Literally or really ever. So annoyed. She is just so not about to deal with them. That's funny. Get out, scavengers! It's me, sir. Can I climb on the moose again? Go ahead. It's annoying that you have to ask him like every time you want to get on the moose. Eh, it's whatever. You only really have to do it once. I just wanted to do that conversation and then actually have a reason. The fire's gone. I can take the berries now. I can't just pull them off with my hands. Better catch them on Thermals. fire! <laughs> okay. Sometimes things just don't work. And inside her head, Fran's like, wow, this player's really fucking stupid. Ah, uh, amazing. There we go. And now we got the water and the fireberries. Wow, it's so much hair and so shiny. Okay, the same thing again. Wow. Um. Ew, I look completely de deformed. I almost said disformed. Am I nutritious? I bet I am. Taste. Right, what? You're the Kamalas, aren't you? Can you talk? Hello? So, uh. So, right, word, here's the bucket full of water. I get help from the shiny insects. You mean the Luciferns? Yeah, they are nice, yes. But only when you see them in this reality. They're very dangerous if you see them in the fifth reality. They can burn you. Wow, bird me? Well, I haven't been to the fifth reality yet. I don't recommend it. What, what's reasonable there may be the worst you'll ever experience. Oh, I forgot to thank you for the water. Thank you, Fran. Sir, I bought the fireberries, but they're not on fire anymore. Magnificent. They'll do just fine. Thank you very much, my darling. I oh, Fran, it's 2.34. The journey will begin. Let's go inside the machine. I wonder what... I wonder if the game lets you give him the water before you get the fireberries. It probably doesn't, because you can't get the fireberries unless you use the water first. But it's just, I've never seen anybody do that. Yeah, I didn't think to do it, but I'm, I'm sure it's possible that they can leave. Sorry for the slight interruption once again. Family things! It's 2.35. We had a great possibility of reaching the target in good condition. We'll soon be on our way to the third reality. Are you excited, Fran? Maybe I'd be excited if I could understand more about the realities. You'll soon understand. The answers are not always easy to recognize. Huh, that sounds strange to me, sir. Time goes as it has to in order for you to be alive. Also, by the way, I'm gonna voice the next the time, up too. If it all happened now, you'd probably even score. Are you telling me that the answers I'm looking for will come to me when they want? Not exactly. You know what? I'd rather say through time, you'd have to explore an experience to understand. This means the answers will come when you find them, not when others tell you how or where to find them. I see. Well, I'm excited now. You woke up my curiousness. That's called That's curiosity, the best thing you can do. sweetie. That's the best thing you can do for yourself. Be curious and you'll always be amazed. But now, friend, we have to get things done. Talking will take you home. What thing, sir? The machine needs some maintenance, and I think you do incredible work. Here are the fireberries and the water you gathered before. I gave them to you for literally no reason. You'll need them to get the water pump working again in the fuel mix. You'll find all useful information when you enter the room to the left. But feel free to enter any room you wish. <laughs> I'll be quite busy fixing the automatic driver. But if you have something to ask, I'll be here. Hmm, 
but I've never done anything like this before. That makes it more exciting. Have fun, my darling. All right, I'll go now. By the way, Cassie? What? Uh, make sure you're not moving your mic. I'm not. Kamala Hunt, press start. Get ready. This game is just great. Okay, now I understand how this works. I didn't understand how this worked before. You have to hold it down. Okay, so these are, uh, it's pretty much Space Invaders, but easy. And now they're moving in different directions because they're weird. You said they were easy, so now they gotta be hard. You insulted them. I don't think so, but alright. Because I'm pretty sure that demon devil guy's still up there. And he's lame as hell. Why you gotta be rude? Winner! Attack of the Easter egg. You. Alright, I think you get an achievement for you in this as well. Mm -hmm. But I've already got the achievement, so once again, more editing in. Don't you love that? Come on, really? Yeah. Nah. Yeah, I'll just sit like this. I'm predicting behavior from the IT work computer database has been found. It, oh, it work. It work has been shut down. Egg, Easter, allowed, zero X, all those numbers and things. Stop. I'm gonna put those in a translator to see if those actually say something, because I'd be curious. So we won. It's amazing and fantastic, and I'm also taking this duct tape. It's not duct tape, it's mechanical tape or some shit. Uh, it, it would be like electrical tape or some, Well, actually, that does not look like electrical tape, but it has the same kind of shiny gloss to it, so I'm assuming that's what it's supposed to be. It says duct tape. Everybody calls you... tape duct tape. That's not duct tape. You know what duct tape looks like. It's gray and it's much larger than that. No, a few things. One, there's thin duct tape and there's duct tape of every color. It's not duct tape. It is duct tape. The game says it's duct tape. You won't decide that. Fran is like a 10 year old girl. She doesn't know what duct tape looks like. Oh, hey, Mr. Midnight. Robo Knight. Maybe it more likes them. Of course, why not? They're so pretty. Okay. This lamp looks like a teapot with forks and spoons. That's because it is, bitch. Many things to look at. I don't think I need any of this. It makes me wonder. There's many things we never really need. That's King Ziar. I recognize him. Hmm, I see now they're friends. That's good. It makes me want to trust it, Word. And if I didn't recognize him, well, that would be incredibly stupid because I saw him five minutes ago. A clock. A clock! A clock! Yay! Hmm, many tiny gloves. They look a bit familiar. Are those gloves I lost through time? Maybe Edward stole these gloves. That's why I lost them. Dick. Oh, this looks like a mathematical problem, but I won't you try to solve like it. You look like a mathematical I have many problem. Other things to do. Really? Stop interrupting me. I wonder what kind of things this machine counts. It doesn't have wires. How does it work? Edward's technology is very amazing. Are you, are you here to kill it, word? God, oh, oh that, that's her talking. Hello, why won't you talk to me? I'm very sorry for what I did. I hope you can forgive me. Also, look at her key. smile. Oh no. Yeah. Um. I wonder what that key goes to. I wonder if it word really does love black cats. If these dolls represent Mr. Midnight, it'd be strange. It would makes me wonder so many things. Oh, hey, books. Oh, so many passages to read. I hope they have pictures. But letters are alright. They tell stuff to imagine. I misunderstand stories sometimes, and that can be a great danger. The flying machine's incredible. It can fly. 
I mean, you never would have guessed based on the name. The door's closed. Maybe we can open it later. Oh, the ladder leads to a door, but it's closed. I don't know how to open door. Oh, wait, were these forks here for? I think so. Why did I not notice that? Why did I not notice that? Because it's just decoration. Gabe, go, go back to the room. God damn it. What? <laughs> There's like a main thing in this room you didn't click. Ha <laughs> ha! I don't see very well. It's quite dark. Uh, the main. Oh, right, yeah, I forgot. Yeah, yeah, Fine. yeah. In a world made of darkness and light, two little sisters tried to steal each other's charm, but none of the sides could decide if what they were was just right. Mia was angry and Clara was sad, and this was because they both were mad. Oh, insane little girls, Inside of their minds, it were the creature of the night. He came always around in dreams or reality, teaching the girls the splendor of duality. But they couldn't understand. Edward was a friend. Edward was the link between darkness and light. He was gray. But Clara and Mia one day decided to get rid of Itward once and for all. Die, creature of the night, die, they said. But they killed each other instead. Dead and gone. The sisters kept complaining about each other. It's all your fault, Clara. It's all your fault, Mia. Then Itward came to visit for the last time. And he said, You are both trapped in the world of disconnections. But I'll give you a chance. The world has been mean to you. They sewed your bodies together to prove that they could. They gave you a mirror to compare yourselves. I'll give you nothing but what you already have and just one tiny little chance to understand the purpose of life. But the clock is ticking. You have until the day a black cat goes missing, and the well's magic door is unlocked. The end.